Rocklahoma and Wildside Radio. Proud to bring you behind the scenes of all the crazy activities backstage from fans like this. Don't miss out on this rare opportunity to have a front row seat backstage at Rocklahoma. 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 Tune into WildSideRadio.com or MySpace.com slash WildSideRadio. And that's spelled with a Y, not an I. Wildside Radio promotions must be 17 or older to view this raunchy kick you in the head. Live footage, live backstage in Rocklahoma 2008. Rated R for viewers who are wild enough to tune in. Corey here on the Wild Side Radio Show, broadcasting all the way from prior Oklahoma at the huge event, or Rocklahoma. I got a huge surprise for especially the ladies out there. That's right. These guys right here are really uh, the ladies' men of the event. <laughs> wow. I got I got the band Dirty Penny sitting right here. Guys, what's shaking? Woo! Oh, no. <laughs> uh, I take that. That's You guys are having a good time, right? Uh, it's impossible to have a bad time here, I think. It's right. impossible. Well, sure. so tell me, how does it feel to be back, or, you know, for round two at Rock, Oklahoma? It's like our homecoming, man. This is, this is where Dirty Penny pretty much started, got off the ground, got everything that we have today. We, we pretty much owe to this festival at this point, so it's fucking great to be back. Good. Yeah, it's the one-year anniversary, basically, of our CD and everything, our career, pretty our much. Story. Yeah, our, our first... Time out of California was Rocklahoma last year, and we had CD was re- released on the day we played Rocklahoma. Yeah. So obviously, you guys are doing much better because the last time I spoke to you guys, you were struggling a little bit, like most all the uh, traveling musicians out there. <laughs> so things are going better now, huh? Yeah, things are going, going good. I mean, we're still definitely uh, we're in a 15 passenger van, and uh, we're not we're not in a bus or anything, and we're doing everything on our own right now. That's huge. Yeah, yeah. totally. I mean, when, we, when we saw you last, we had the, the typical you hear from every band, the stereotypical. Leech bullshit manager that comes out of nowhere and says he could promises you the world and gives you shit. So we we ditched him. We doing it all ourselves now and we're doing great. We're doing awesome. Great. You know, and that's the way to do it. You know, if it, if somebody can't get it to work for you, you got to make it work for yourself. Yeah, exactly, and exactly. obviously, you guys are doing a Nobody great job. Nobody can do it as good as you can do it yourself. Pretty right. Much. Well, now all the all the resources that are out there today, it ain't it ain't hard. It ain't hard to sell our CD around the world on our own. Well, this year, you guys, oh, before I get into this, last year, I, I keep forgetting to ask you guys this question. Last year, you played main stage, right? Yeah. At the end of your set, you guys were arrested. Yeah. What was up with that? That was just a fun little thing that we did. Yeah. It was just a fun I mean, thing. I've heard so many rumors from it's him. Spanky whipped his balls out Yeah, him dropping his pants or me getting naked or whatever, but we actually, we... We know a girl whose dad was is like the chief of police here, and he came up and asked us if we wanted to fuck around. And, oh, can I? Cast You're okay. Uh, if we wanted to like fuck around and do something cool, and we're like, hell yeah! And he's like, all right, I'll have you know. And we came up with that idea, and it was great. It, it, it a was buzz, great. You know? It was a huge buzz because I I, I saw the performance, yeah. and when I saw, it, I thought, you know, okay, now was this staged or <laughs> not? Because they were actually pretty rough with you. Too. Oh yeah, we told them to be. Yeah. <laughs> I actually had a chick cop get me, so I had to fake it a little bit, but it's, uh, <laughs> it's all good. Yeah. I was so sweaty and disgusting, she didn't even want to touch me, but that's all right. Uh, I'm sure. <laughs> well, that's real cool. Okay, so now you guys have been, you know, you haven't had the chance, obviously, because you've been on the tour. You haven't had the chance to step into the studio do any new stuff. Yeah. But uh, fortunately, you guys have something coming maybe at the end of the summer for all your fans, right? Yeah, we, uh, we're just finishing up our first full U.S. tour. Uh, it ends, like, August 2nd. And then we're going to go home and take two to three months off to finish writing because we're about halfway done writing our CD. So we're going to finish writing our CD and then go into the studio as soon as we're done. We're hoping to be done out of the studio by the end of the year, released within, you know, early 2000, whatever this year is. Keep keep the machine rolling, you know? Now, we just had the band Big Hawk in here, and they're really psyched about doing a show with you guys in Phoenix, Arizona. Oh, yeah. yeah. And that's coming up, yes. So With August uh, 1st. August 1st. There we go. That's right. That's like... That's actually, I think if that nothing Martini changes, Ranch. that's our last show of this tour. That's our this tour. Oh, that's really? our in Phoenix? final wow. show of this tour. So that's gonna be a good grand finale right there. Yeah, yeah they know, know how to put on a hell of a show. You know, they they, they do it right. So we're stoked to go out with them too. Well, you guys fit together. You guys fit the role together and put on a huge show. Well, so okay, obviously you guys are going on stage here pretty soon. Now you guys got retrospect got, or you got the tri stage. Tri level yeah, stage, that's right. And uh, so after this, I mean, you know, you, once again, you're playing the biggest event of the nation right here in Prior, Oklahoma. 
after this, where are you guys going? You guys got anything huge lined up? We're doing the uh, huge. Uh, I mean, we're continuing the tour. Correct. We're heading up to we Kansas. Some, we got some big shows in uh, in Kansas, Oklahoma, Texas, and then Arizona. We're just making our way back to California. Are you guys doing the Texas Texas Festival that's going this weekend? Or? No, we actually we got we we got into it kind of late because we were working with Rocklahoma for so long. Right. We finally got in contact with them, and they offered us like a show to play for like four hours or something like that and they weren't you know it was just it just wasn't going to work out which is cool but we just actually met the guy from uh yeah, we might do rock the bayou it's just labor day weekend yeah. we got a big we're doing we're, we're going up to canada to open up for rat in calgary at uh, august 31st so we might be able to do rock the bayou right. around august 30th with Rat and then go up to Canada with Rat too. There you yeah. go. So we'll just well, fly so. with them. Well, what's pretty special is not only you guys get the opportunity to play on stage here to the fans, you guys have been doing some VIP backs, back, you know, back in the VIP uh, camping. Oh yeah. Uh, tell me this: what's the difference between the fans between the two? Okay, well, the v basically <laughs> out there, everybody's there for a concert, right? You know, they're right. there to see the band, and that's the way they're there. When you go to the back, it's like oh, no holds barred, a huge fucking after party. That's what it is, and everybody is just. Twice as crazy, twice as drunk. Ugh, it was. It's just so the much fun. Energy, the energy level of the shows too, just because we're right there in their face, yeah. is just fucking amazing, and it brings right. something out of us that's special and also out of. The well, band. I yeah. saw you guys last night. I went to go see you guys play. Of course, you guys came on right after the Gypsy Pistorellos. Yeah. Then we went back there to see you guys play, and we heard the music playing. We were having a hard time finding the stage. We went back there, and you guys had a standing crowd only, and there must have been a good 500 people just standing around. I couldn't even get, you know, 200 feet to the stage. I could just see the top of your spikes moving around. <laughs> Honestly, that that's what we that's what we fucking live for. I mean, the, the big stage it's awesome because it's just that that huge. You know, you could run around. You, you have that huge sound. But yeah, we're not running into each other on the yeah, on the big yeah. stage. But, but it's the energy of those fucking people. This is some of our. This is probably some of our best fans in the world. They've been drinking since 10 o'clock in the morning. It's 3 or 4 in the morning. These people are fucking partying hard. It is. So it's just the energy is just out of control. It's fucking wild. And it, it, it's fun. It I remember I, I had more fun at the back parties than the main stage last year. Right. Yeah. Oh, Dirty Penny lives for a fucking drunken backyard party. I'll tell you that. There you go. Yeah. Well, you guys are young enough to do it. <laughs> Myself, I don't know how you guys are doing this it. This is my I'm first day in <laughs> so long that I'm not hungover. I can't. That's nice. I don't know if that's bad. But I think he's nice. just used to it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now you guys got the, the CD out right now. Now where can the fans and all the listeners go to pitch, uh, take, you know, purchase your CD and maybe a few singles off the, of the CD as well? Uh, you can get it off iTunes. It's on iTunes and then also um, DirtyPennySucks.com. We have right. a full shop. We have t-shirts, sweatshirts, bandanas, hats, yeah. back panties, patches. back patches. We, got a great, we do our own distribution. It's mailed out the day you order it. It's uh, nice. you can get all of our merchandise with uh, you don't need to be you know registered with how iTunes and CD Baby and all that you don't have to be a member you can just go in buy your stuff get it a couple days later we're, 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 gonna, we're, we're gonna end up dirtypennysucks.com we're gonna end up having more merchandise than Kiss there you go that's our goal <laughs> now, you know, now that you mentioned that I mean that makes it so convenient for people to be able to go in just get in buy it and get out I don't have to be a membership I don't have yeah, to sign up yeah, I don't have to wait for your credit card on file and Get in and get out. Like people from like, cause you they don't understand it. anywhere in the world. All you gotta do is order it, and it'll get to you. Like that works. People, and people don't understand. They write off like, "Are you sure you can do it?" We're like, "Yes, order it, and two days later it'll be at your fucking doorstep." Okay. Oh, dirty we've, penny. We've looked into it. We've looked we've into actually, it. We've actually, yeah, we have looked into it. They're pretty cheap, actually. It might be it's from soon. Keep your eyes open. Yeah, and Dirty are, Penny pregnancy tests are you guys, coming are, out soon. Are you guys We're just like, thinking about Dirty Penny vasectomies, you know, <laughs> take home kids. Are you guys going to individually, uh, you know, maybe name him like the Big Binge? And, oh, uh, wow. <laughs> the, the Swampy Sap. I don't know. We haven't, thought of, we haven't even thought about that, but that's Don a fucking Yang. great idea. That's a great idea. It's <laughs> a great idea. It's a great idea. All right, guys, you know what? I want you to go out there tonight and just, you know, tear them up. You know, oh, yeah, we're gonna thank do what we you do. so much for being here once again. Oh, yeah. Thank oh, you for having us, man. It's Absolutely. great to see you. Absolutely. Thank you very Absolutely. much for having us. Woo! You bet. Wild Side. Wild Side Radio Show. The wildest radio show on the planet.